The topic for this video is database management system. In this video, we are going to study what is DBMS, what are the components of DBMS, and what are its application. So now let's begin with the question what. Now what is database management system which is DBMS? It is basically the collection of data. That data which contains information relevant to an enterprise. Now the primary goal of a DBMS is basically to store and retrieve information from that pool of information in an efficient and convenient manner. For example, if we are talking about a university, it contains both students and your faculty members. The information about these students and faculty members need to be stored somewhere or the other. So the information about students roll number, its course, grade, year and such details about students and similarly about faculty are stored in DBMS where the information is stored in same format and the information is also correlated. So there are records, there are tables made in tabular form and information is stored. So this is DBMS. Now what are the components of DBMS? It basically has four components. First one is users. Users basically who use the DBMS. There are three categories of users. One is application programmers. Second is end users and third is DBA that is database administrator. These three users play different role. What application programmers does is they develop programs that can manipulate database in different ways. Because when we need to retrieve information from the database, there need to be a query language or, a, or an application program to retrieve the information. And that application program is developed by the application programmers. Now when we talk about end users, end users has the access to database, but that can only be done using a query language or through the programs that were developed by application programmers. Third is the DBA, that is database administrator. and this user is responsible for the design, construction and maintenance of a database. So these were the different roles that were assigned to these users. Next component is the software which involves the operating system, network software and application programs. Simple softwares that are needed to run uh, package. Third component of DBMS is the hardware that can be a PC or it can be a network of computers, storage devices, output devices and so on. Fourth component is the data. Data that has to be stored in the database which can be both numbers, characters, pictures, images, anything. So the four components are user, software, hardware and data. The various applications of DBMS, that is where this DBMS can be used. It can be used in banking, where DBMS is used to maintain the customer details, the account details, the loan details. It can be used in universities as we've already discussed for storing the information of students or faculty members or any other person that is part of that university, the information has to be stored. Next can be railway reservations, hospitals, maintaining the records of the patients, finance sector and many more. So this was a brief overview of what is database management system. Thank you.